Thank you very much for coming. Today we came to court for the court to issue a ruling on deferment of plea taking on the proposed charges that the state are trying to illegally bring against my client Jimmy Wanjigi. And uh, we informed the court that there are proceedings going on in the High Court and in one of the files the High Court has stayed any further proceedings or prosecutions in relation to the proposed charges until the petition filed in the High Court is heard and determined. And we invited the court to consider that ruling and at this stage to arrest its ruling and stay its proceedings in recognition of the High Court order. We did also inform the court that the matter in the High Court is coming up on the 19th of September and that we can report back to court on what the position of the High Court is once it considers these matters. And the court has a quiz to that request. So we are coming back on the 26th of September for further directions. But I must say this. It is important that we note that we are operating within the purview of the rule of law. And as opposed to acting Inspector General of Police Convict Masiangeli, we obey court orders as and when they are issued. Convict Masiangeli is a notorious uh, abuser of the court process. He doesn't respect court orders. He has disobeyed seven court orders. He has been convicted. He is supposed to be sentenced tomorrow. As opposed to him, as we believe in the judicial process, we submit to the courts and the authority and we respect their orders. And you also witnessed today in court, even the state representatives who are not averse to respecting the court orders. And this should be a lesson to convict Masiangeli. You need to report to court tomorrow to be convicted and sentenced to committee. If not committee, Kodiaga. If not Kodiaga, Manyani. And the Kenyan citizens have a responsibility to arrest you and to take you to any of those facilities in defense of our constitution. Thank you very much. That's all I have to say. We also have with us the president of Bunge La Mwanainchi, Jakaranda. Uh, some of the members of that Bunge had also equally been illegally arrested and arraigned in court on uh, similar issues, allegedly because they are associated with uh, Mr. Jimmy Wanjiki. Uh, so they were arrested and they planted fake explosives on them and purported to charge them for that offense and uh, allegedly for creating disturbance. 